NASA's Juno spacecraft captures cyclone storms on the surface of Jupiter in jaw-dropping new image. The orbiting spacecraft has captured a stunning picture of the surface of the planet. NASA has revealed a stunning new picture of the surface of Jupiter, taken by its orbiting Juno spacecraft. The jaw-dropping image shows a swirling mass of cyclone storms dominating the surface of the biggest planet in our solar system. The storms consist of a mixture of liquid hydrogen and helium in the center with vast atmospheric jet streams and exotic gravitational properties, scientists said on Wednesday. Data from NASA's Juno spacecraft, orbiting the solar system's largest planet since 2016, is providing researchers with what they called unprecedented insight into Jupiter's internal dynamics and structure. Until now, Scientists have had scant information about what lies below Jupiter's thick red, brown, yellow and white clouds. Juno is designed to look beneath these clouds, said planetary science professor Yohai Kospi of the Weizmann Institute of Science in Israel, who led part of the research using Juno's new measurements of Jupiter's gravity. On Jupiter, a gaseous planet without a solid surface, we can only gather information from orbit added aerospace engineering professor Luciano I.S. of Sapienza University of Rome, who also led part of the research. Jupiter is a type of planet called a gas giant, as opposed to rocky planets like Earth and Mars, and its composition is 99% hydrogen and helium. Juno's data showed that as you go deeper under the surface, Jupiter's gas becomes ionized and eventually turns into a hot, dense metallic liquid. The scientists said Jupiter's jet streams, related to the familiar stripes on its surface, plunge some 1,800 miles 3, kilometers, below cloud level, and that its deep interior is comprised of a fluid hydrogen and helium mixture that rotates as if it were a solid body. The very center may contain a core made of high-pressure and high-temperature rocks and perhaps water, but it is believed to be fluid as well, not solid said planetary scientist Tristan Gillow of the Universite Côte d'Azur in Nice, another of the research leaders. Juno's data showed a small but significant asymmetry between the gravitational field of Jupiter's northern and southern hemispheres, driven by the immense jet streams. The deeper the jet streams go, the more mass they contain, exerting a strong effect on Jupiter's gravitational field, Cospi said. Jupiter the fifth planet from the Sun, dwarfs the solar system's other planets, measuring about 89,000 miles kilometers, in diameter at its equator, compared with Earth's diameter of about 8,000 miles kilometers. It is big enough that 1,300 Earths could fit inside it, 